Hello, I'm Tom Hughes, the Programme Lead for the MSc in Molecular Medicine in Leeds. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about our programme and in, in particular what skills and experience it might give you to help build your career in the future. Firstly, what do we mean by molecular medicine? So in our programme, we use this to mean the study of the molecular basis of a range of diseases. So it's about the molecules that cause these diseases and it's about the molecules that can be used in diagnosis or treatment. So what's special about our programme in Leeds? Firstly, we'll give you the opportunity to engage in impactful research. So that will be your research project embedded in a research team in our institute doing work that will hopefully be important and potentially publishable. Secondly, you'll be taught by academic experts and world leading scientists and clinicians within our institute. So the tutors and the project supervisors really are uh, notable experts in their fields. Thirdly, you can choose from a range of optional modules to match the program to your specific interests so you can fine tune it to what you find exciting. So the program is structured around delivering core skills and subject specific specialist knowledge. So to focus first on these core skills, um, these skills will help you to firstly understand the principles and application of research design and methods in molecular medicine, uh, will help you develop skills in research presentation and analysis of data and communicating those data to people. Uh, we'll actually teach you how to work in the lab itself, so learn actual molecular lab skills. Uh, and I already mentioned the project, which is a really important uh, component of the skills that you'll gain. Secondly, um, you get to uh, learn about a number of different topics in the specialist modules. So for these, you get to gain state-of-the-art knowledge in subjects such as genetics, cell biology and development, immune defects, and rare genetic diseases. And again, to highlight that this is delivered by some of the people doing uh, the most up-to-date research in these areas. So the program is delivered within the Leeds Institute of Medical Research at St. James's. This is the largest institute within the School of Medicine. So there's a, a lot of people around. Uh, it's a research intensive environment. So that means that there aren't undergraduates here. It really is a, a research institute and feels like a, a proper start into uh, research science. Uh, and it's populated by these world leading research scientists and clinical tutors. Within the Institute, we have uh, quite a wide range of research going on that's into diseases, uh, haematology, cancer research, gastroenterology, surgery and pathology. So there's a wide range of areas for you to do your research project. Who should apply for our programme? Uh, we actually get applications from a really wide range of backgrounds, but probably the most suitable are people who have first degrees of some type in biology or biomedicine, sometimes uh, medics um, who want to, to learn about the more molecular side of medicine. Uh, but I, we also have chemists, sometimes bioengineers. We've even had computer scientists who are keen to develop their molecular skills. Um, so I, I'd advise you to contact the, the program team and ask whether your background's relevant if it's uh, at, at the edges of those subject areas. But the key point is whether you, that you need to have an interest in gaining state-of-the-art knowledge about the molecules relating to disease and, uh, and learn skills to try and do your own research in those areas in the future. What is that future for most of our gra graduates? Well, generally, they go on to jobs within research in, in some form, generally. Now, that's often as PhD students, and we have a, a good track record of uh, loading people into PhD programs, um, sometimes within Leeds, uh, but often it's research jobs within industry. Uh, we've had graduate entry medicine people and sometimes uh, people going into management of research. So it's a really um, excellent training for people who want to stay within this area. So if you want further information on the course, here are some links so that you can uh, find a there's a, a contact email so that you can uh, ask specific questions if you want. Thank you very much for listening.